Hi everyone, Yasas Ke Kalosir Tata to another episode of Dimitra's Dishes. Today we are making lavraki. Lavraki is the Greek word for Mediterranean sea bass. In Italian, it's also known as branzino. It's so delicious. It's a nice light fish. This is a nice, elegant dinner idea for a dinner party, but it also comes together so quickly that you can make this for your family on any busy weeknight. As long as you have the fish on hand and it's cleaned and ready to cook, you'll have this on the table in no time. Let's get started. So I'm making a double batch of this because I had four fish so I'm gonna make all of them this is four pounds of bronzino that I got from my local market and it's already been cleaned and everything all I have to do is season it before you season it you're gonna to have to cut some slits on the front and on the back so that way it just cooks evenly so do that first so what you do is just you drizzle a little bit of olive oil all over the fish and inside too and then you season it inside and outside front and back with some salt and some black pepper simple i don't put lemon slices in it or anything like that because sometimes when i i have tested it that way and the lemon um, peel and the rind gives it sort of a bitter taste and i like the lemony flavor to be fresh and light and to come from the lado lemon dressing that we're going to put on top of this once it's cooked so that's it once the fish is seasoned you're going to put it on a baking tray that's lined with parchment paper and put it in a preheated 400 degree oven for just 20 25 minutes that's all it takes and then the fish is going to be ready once it comes out let it rest a little bit in the meantime i like to serve this with some lemony roasted potatoes i just pressure cook my potatoes so it could be quick they're ready in the pressure cooker for six minutes you just cook them in some salted water take them out drain them and then just cut them into cubes just big pieces nothing fancy and then i like to put them in a big bowl and drizzle some olive oil like a quarter of a cup of olive oil over them lemon juice as much as you like two four six tablespoons just taste it and add more more if you want to as you go and then season with salt and pepper toss it all together i like to do this while the potatoes are still warm so they absorb all of that flavor then i transfer them into my air fryer's basket and i'm just going to roast them at 400 degrees for 15 minutes they're going to get sort of crispy on the outside they're going to be lemony and soft on the inside they're just going to be perfect if you don't have an air fryer you could definitely bake these in the oven same seasoning same everything you just put it in a 400 degree oven for about 20 or 30 minutes or until they get nice and crispy and then they're ready to be served while that's all happening you're going to make the lado lemon dressing now this is where all of the flavor it's going to, is going to come from i'm making a big batch because i have extra fish here so you're going to put a freshly squeezed lemon juice in a bowl i have about a cup of it here or maybe three quarters of a cup I haven't really measured but the measurements on the blog are going to be for half the size of the servings but anyway so you're going to put the lemon juice in the mixing bowl and then add some garlic I just like to grate two garlic cloves and put them in there fresh garlic and then olive oil you almost double the amount of olive oil that you have of the lemon juice and it sounds like a lot but it's delicious and it's healthy too. And then it's not traditional, but I do like to add a little bit of mustard. It helps the dressing hold together and emulsify. You can leave it out if you don't like it. Just keep in mind that you're gonna to have to continue to whisk it before you serve it because the, the olive oil and the lemon juice are going to separate. But the mustard really does add another layer of flavor in there. So add it if you like it. And a heaping teaspoon or two of dried oregano and a little pinch of salt to tie all the flavors together. Whisk that all up and then it's ready to be served. Once the fish comes out of the oven, you could just put it on a serving platter. And then when it's ready to serve, put it on the plate with some potatoes and then open it up and drizzle as much of that lado lemon dressing as your heart desires. It's so good. The more, the better. If you want to finally chop some fresh parsley and put that on top, that's fine too. But it's ready to be served just as is. And it's time for the taste test. So light and fresh. The fish tastes perfect. It's flaky. It's not overcooked. And that, that dressing is just everything. It's so good. Let's taste the potatoes too. They're nice and soft on the inside, crisp on the outside. And I like to dip them in that sauce. Perfect. You can serve this fish with some sauteed greens with some, lem some lemon juice on top, some lemony Mediterranean rice pilaf, hearty, crusty bread. It's up to you, but it's a nice, light, elegant dinner to serve to your favorite people. I hope you guys give this a try. The exact measurements and the printable recipe is on the website, DemetrisDishes.com. Go over there, print it out, and make it. If you can't find branzino, you can use any white fish that you, that you can find, like red snapper would work for this. 
sea bream or even swordfish. Just let me know what you're using in the comment section. I hope you guys give this a try. Thank you so much for spending time with me today. I'll see you all next time. Yes, us.